Bowman here and welcome to yet another vlog. This week I am going to do a follow up of a previous vlog that I did involving my record collection and if you remember I said that later I would give y'all a tour through my CD collection so I decided to do something kind of simple this week and show all my CDs to y'all. So, alright. I have Out of the Grey, which if you don't know who they are, they were a very popular husband and wife duo in the 90s. We have, I have four of their CDs. I have Shape of Grace, uh, Out of the Grey, I think that's their self-titled, and Gravity, and See Inside. You knew this was coming, but my Amy Grant CDs, of course, is Behind the Eyes. House of Love, Heart in Motion. And next is one of my favorite, one of my all-time favorite artists, Susan Ashton. Her self-titled album, Susan Ashton, A Distant Call, Angels of Mercy, and Wakened by the Wind. Connie Scott. I have Connie Scott, Hold On, Forever Young, and Live to Tell. I have David Meese's Once in a Lifetime. Kim Hill, The Fire Again, of which I have actually not listened to much. I need to take a listen to that more. Kim Boyce, The Definitive Collection. I got this on a super awesome sale. It was like four or five dollars at the Christian bookstore on clearance. Judgment, The Trial of Commander Kelly. You probably have not heard of this. I highly doubt because it's not extremely popular. Um, from Commander Kelly and the Super Kids. This is not my only CD. They released what it basically a CD accompanying as a motion picture soundtrack for each movie they produced from Kenneth Copeland Ministries. And I have all of them except the first one, I believe. I have Judgment. I do not have it in front of me, but I also have The Sword and Armor of Light. Those three CDs I do believe. To show you how old I am, I first listened to this on cassette. So yeah, I started watching their movies and stuff on VHS and cassette. So yeah, 90s kid. Next up we have Cindy Morgan. I have two of her CDs, Real Life and Under the Waterfall. Daryl Mansfield, Born to be Wild, y'all. This is like one of the best CDs ever. This is Daryl Mansfield. He took lots of popular secular songs of the, of the 80s and such and put a little twist on the lyrics to sanctify it a little bit and bring it into CCM. Songs like Born to be Wild or Spirit in the Sky um, instead of Lowrider and Backslider. So uh, Walking in God's Love is one of my favorite ones. Y'all I've had so many dance parties with that song. It's not even funny. Alright, John Elefante, the wonderful frontman for the wonderful band Kansas. And of course, they had some CCM crossover when John Elefante was their frontman. Of course, if you did not know that, you know that now. Because that's a proud trivia. But of John El Elefante's collection, I have Corridors and Defying Gravity. Michael W. Smith, Smitty. I have Change Your World and This Is Your Time. I have used three songs for this from this CD on three of my Walker Texas Ranger YouTube videos. So you know it's gotta be good, man. Another one of my absolute favorite female CCM singers is Margaret Becker. And I have Simple House on CD and this is Steps of Faith. It's like a collection and I don't have the case in here with me. It's like I think it's in my Jeep. But anyway, I it's sold. That's probably my favorite album first, is Soul. It's just one of the best. But Steps of Faith, this is kind of like a best of collection. I have, wow, 1999 hits. I was just listening to this the other night. It totally took me back in time. They even put his cheeseburger from VeggieTales on here. That is so cool. I have Rachel Rachel, the best 80s female band to come from CCM that, you know, probably would be like Heart, The Christian Heart or something like that. They only released two CDs, period. I have one of the two and I plan to get the other when I can. Kathy Tricoli, Corner of Eden. 
I have her CD. I want Pure Attraction, but that's just beside the point. That's one of my favorites of hers, but I don't have it yet. For him, Basics of Life, Rich Mullen, Songs, John Gibson, another one of my absolute favorites. I have said that way too much, but I have Love Education, and of course y'all heard me talk about his two other records that I have on vinyl. Leslie Phillips, The Turning, another awesome deal I got at the Christian Bookstore because they were getting rid of it, which I don't know why they would want to get rid of this good stuff. Anyway, for the sake of the call, Stephen Curtis Chapman, Carmen Riot. People, if you know me, this is some good stuff right here. We want a riot. Avalon, in a different light. This CD is one that is really important to me. I really enjoyed it because it put together some of the best talent, in my opinion. Susan Ashton, Margaret Becker, and Christine Dante. She was from Out of the Gray. These three wonderful ladies got together and produced this one CD together as the group Ashton Becker and Dante, and it was called Along the Road. I This is one of my favorite CDs, and I wish they would have made more together. They are so talented as a trio. This is another one of those rare things that, um, rare CDs that you will not find hardly anywhere anymore, but I'm so blessed to have been able to find some of this wonderful God-honoring CCM music that is just, today's music is great and all, but, you know, I really love yesteryear's music. And just as a bonus, I actually have a few cassettes here I want to share. Rust Taff is self-titled cassette. And Idle Cure, people, Idle Cure is one of the best CC and rock bands out there ever. I want more of their music on CD, record, whatever I can get. I have their cassette, Second Avenue, and Tough Love. I have, whoa, I'm just throwing it in my face. But I have their two cassettes, and I treasure these, and I'm glad to own some of Idle Cure's music because their music is incredible. Again, I used one of their songs for a Walker Texas Stranger video too called Breakaway, and it is one of my best, but I will not get on that rabbit trail today. So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed my little journey into my classic Christian music CD collection. And I will see y'all next week for another wonderful video. If you like what you've seen in this video, please like, subscribe, and share with your friends. And don't forget to turn that little bell icon on so you don't miss a beat. Thank y'all for joining me this week, and I will see y'all next time.